I'm planning a trip to Japan next year during the Chinese New Year holidays and by booking my flights and accommodations via Shopback, I get 388 Shopback cashback and 11,840 Chris Flyer miles or a total of $520 cashback. Besides receiving rewards from credit cards you already have, did you know that you could be receiving more money back on a platform like Shopback. When they reached out wanting to educate Singaporeans of the platform, of course, I agreed. I'm sure many of you have already heard of them or seen Shopback payments in stores at your favorite merchants, but there could be more you might not know of. So let's dive straight into today's video. Let's go. Looking back on my transaction history, the earliest cashback was 4th of May 2019. And considering the fact that I had only used it a handful of times for a few bookings on Agoda Booking.com, I accumulated a total of $291 thus far. So Shopback has this trip testing promotion going on every 21st to 23rd of the month, giving us up to 10% cashback on flights and up to 15% cashback on hotel bookings. So here's the breakdown on how I got this much rewards back. When I was looking for hotels, Fraser Residence Nankai Osaka was what I decided to go with. And for 15% cashback on my amount before taxes, I'll be getting $295.59 back. And for two air tickets flying on Peach Aviation, 10% cashback on prices before taxes will give me $92.80 cashback. This in total is $388.39 just by booking my flights and accommodations during this promotion. Not only will I receive shop back cashback, I'll be receiving credit card rewards as well. So going the mouse route for my flights, I'm using the DBS Woman's World MasterCard that gives me four miles per dollar capped at $1,500 every single month. My flight will cost $1,116.20, which equates to 4,460 Chris Flyer miles. And for my hotel booking, I'm using the UOB Chris Flyer credit card that gives 3 miles per dollar, no monthly cap. I just need to hit that $800 SIA spending in that year and I'll qualify for this. So $2,463.24 for my hotel booking will give me 7,380 Chris Flyer miles. Planning this trip using Shopback plus all the credit cards that I have will give me a total of 11,840 Chris Flyer miles and $388.39 Shopback cashback. And because I've already accumulated all of the miles that I need to fly my mom on a business class trip, I can also opt to use cashback credit cards. And if I were to use a cashback credit card, I'd be paying my flights using the UOB1 credit card that will give me 3.33% in the $1,000 spending tier and our net $33.30 back. And for my hotel booking, I'll use the Trust Cashback Credit Card that gives 4.89% effective cashback rate on $2,000 expenditures, which I'll get $97.80. All in all, in total, going the cashback route, I'll be receiving a little under $520, which is almost equivalent to one of our flight tickets. The year-end holidays are approaching and you're looking to book a hotel or a flight, make sure you book during trip testing deal that happens every 21st to 23rd of the month for up to 10 to 15% cashback. Using Shopback is really easy and not complicated at all. Just remember to start your shopping by checking Shopback first and fret not that there are many other merchants, not just travel merchants. You'll see Nike, Samsung, JD Sports, Lulu Lemon as well, which you can get up to 25% cashback. Shopping is made even easier with Shopback's button if you're shopping on your computer. So when you are shopping directly at your favorite stores, should Shopback work at that merchant, you'll receive a pop-up notification to prompt you to activate. Continue shopping and once you've checked out, you receive an email to confirm that your cashback is on the way. Shopback's button is available on Chrome, Firefox, and Microsoft Edge. Just go to shopback.sg, scroll all the way down to the bottom of the homepage and you'll find it so that you can install on your browser. Another feature that I really love is vouchers available on Shopback platform. This is new even for myself. These days, I kept to and fro for my sister's place pretty often whenever she needs help and had I purchased Gojek vouchers, I would have saved 8% on top of my credit card rewards. And there are a lot of merchants on Shopback's platform. You have things like Shopee, Lazada, Ikea, Klook, Gojek, Tada, Grab Gifts, FairPrice, Deliveroo, Zalora, Shein and many many others as well. And these Shopback cashback can be easily redrawn back to your bank account. Remember earlier in this video, I mentioned you probably would have seen Shopback in stores when you're making payment, do you notice this QR code? 
that is Shopback Pay. If you had downloaded Shopback's app on your mobile phone, all you need to do is just press the middle button where you can scan that QR code and make your payment on Shopback's app so you can earn some form of cashback in addition to your credit card rewards as well. And for those of you who are using credit cards, which requires it to be an online transaction, you can actually link the payment over here and that will make it an online payment. Working on this video actually made me discover more than I actually thought I knew of Shopback. And incorporating this to our daily lives can actually help you and I to save a little on our already incurring expenses. I hope this video has been helpful for you. If you want to download Shopback, use my link down in the description box below. And if you have any questions, as always, leave it down in the comment section below or you can direct message me over here on my official Instagram account. I hope this helps you to save a little more since things are getting a little bit more expensive. That's all I have for today's video. I'll see you guys in my next one. Have a great week ahead. Bye-bye.